Hello. In part one, we talked a little bit about the stages of decomposition and how they can be used to estimate the post-mortem interval. So we're going to continue that now and talk about stage two. So uh, I asked you all before what you might expect to see in this stage of decomposition. So stage two, again, is the bloat stage of decomposition. And what happens, just as the name suggests, is that the body is going to appear sort of swollen or bloated. And this happens about zero to 10 days after death. So this is gonna depend a little bit on the environment. And during this stage, we see putrefaction. And what that is, is it's a stage when all the bacteria in the body gets really active. So after death, um, the bacteria starts to destroy the soft tissue and starts to form gas as it's moving around and doing stuff inside your body. So you see the body start to get larger and then uh, exteriorly, or on the exterior, we see that the skin starts to slip. We see this marble-like appearance of the skin. So it's gonna have a slight discoloration. Um, we see green or even shades of gray appearing on the body. And we see further destruction caused by insect activity. So we're gonna see, this at this stage in decay, we see the insects are really attracted to that odor of decomposition. So let's take a look at our pig here and see what's going on with it. So at this stage, you can see that the body is very much swollen in, compared to, in comparison to that first image that we saw in part one. So it's large, it's swollen, and it also has that greenish or gray discoloration going on. And uh, we also see that uh, we have some fluids starting to form around the outside of the body. So all the pressure that's building up from the uh, from the gases and the bacteria activity inside the body is causing these fluids to leak out of the uh, body openings. And we're also, uh, because these fluids are starting to leak out, we're smelling the, the odor of decay really, really strong. So what do you think happens next?